All right, we are back, folks. Winter time is definitely here, man. We got the winter gear on. We got all these awesome, awesome fish biting machines out there, those crappie I'm talking about. And we're gonna put a ton of fish in the boat. I'm gonna show you some active captain. Just to remind you guys real quick, we've got a lot of awesome deals going on right now with Black Friday. Hair jig, sniping braid, even the new sniping cat braid, jigs, bait pop, all these products are basically 20% off if you go to those websites, baitpop.com, all that stuff. And probably, you know, the copy formulation, that's what I love using on these hair jigs. We might even use some of these hair jigs today. That's just a little, a little sampling. So uh, check out all those products for your holiday savings because this is definitely the time to, to buy up right now for your season. So let's put some fish in the boat. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies. First fish of the day, folks. That didn't take long. He ain't the biggest fish, though. He is definitely not the biggest fish. We have caught some dandies lately. This is not one of them. He's a starter. We're just casting at him at 30 feet thin. Oh, awesome fish. Oh, man. Right there, folks. That is a hammer. That is an awesome fish right there. Now that is using a hair jig, a 1 16th ounce, fishing a little deeper, and definitely using the, uh, here, let me show you what it is. We'll let this guy go, but that's a great fish. Oh. All right, so just gotta show you what I was using. Now, these hair jigs are available online. I make the gumdrop. This is a three pound fishing specialty. Um, check it out. It also is on sale 20% off of these Black Friday deals right now. So you need, to, you need to take advantage of it totally, in my opinion. It is, without a doubt, probably one of the best jigs that I make. Um, I use it everywhere, it just seems to be. And it's, it's how it's made, it's the products that are made with it that I think makes it a little special so but for the most part what I use especially on my home lake is I use the 30 second ounce jigs like this now what's the advantage of the three pound fishing jig and I'll just let you know that wire keepers on the back side I love it it's a it's not a thin wire so it'll bend it will not break it will bend it will not break and the eyelets are perfect for the small diameter sniping braid Always serious about that when I say braid regardless of the uh, regardless of the brand you use if you're using a micro braid I mean something small 0 0.10 millimeters you need an eyelet that is absolutely perfect otherwise it'll find the imperfections and I know if you if you've done it you know what I'm talking about you know you hook a fish and all of a sudden the loop knot is still there but because it found an imperfection in that eyelet and so the the advantage that these jigs have, the three pound fishing, we call them pig stickers, um, is that those eyelets are perfect. They're always closed. So, and they're always paint free. Check them out, threepoundfishing.com. Uh, let's get some casting done and I'm gonna show you guys some active captain. That's coming up here, let's do that. You know, one of the great things about my lake, my home lake is that uh, we do a lot of schooling fish in the winter time. And, you know, this is a really shallow school right here that you're seeing, small too. They're moving, a lot less likely to hit if they're moving like this, um, but we will throw down there just to see if we can't get one that'll, yeah, see one's actually gonna come to it. And we're gonna play with them a little bit. And he did hit it, good night. You didn't see it on active captain because I was trying to turn it, but that's how, I mean, that's really a great active captain. 
you know what? I mean, that's a solid fish right there. And that's a, a very active fish. So now we're looking for that school again. And pretty much for the most part, for the most part, those fish will stay about the same size. So there's that school right there. It'll drop down a little bit. And it's a game. There's no specific area. You just gotta find where the schools are at. And uh, they tend to stay in that area for a little bit. Then you have to go find them again. Um, but there they are right there. Again, trying to cast just slightly out in front of them. It will make you a sharpshooter for your casting. There I am coming in. And uh, again, if they're moving, a little less likely, but these guys seem to be somewhat aggressive. Yep, they are aggressive. So, <laughs> this guy's a little smaller. How fun is this, man? That is a small school too, let me tell you. They tend to be, the schools can be a lot more, a lot, a lot bigger for sure. And look at that. They're only 15 feet away, so a little flip, change the so I get better view on the live scope. Look at this guy, he's following it. He's gonna hit it. And there he is. Aggressive, aggressive, small school. And this bait is beat up. And a lot of times you can just pitch to them. You don't even have to cast to them if they're if they're not gonna get too spooked. So there we are, we're right in them now. Take notice. One has taken notice. See him coming up. As soon as you lower it to him, they lose interest in. Oh, a little jigging action gets it done. Good fish, dude. All I was doing, I was keeping that fish, that bait down there, and I wasn't getting any action, but the, just the occasional little jig, that's a solid fish. And uh, he hit it, he hammered it. That black jig is loving it. This is the uh, sniping braid optimal. This is an old rod I had. I've broken quite a few of my rods now. I'm down to, down to four 10 footers. That's all I've got to my name. Ozark Rods has been uh, sold out. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting, just like everybody else. Uh, they'll get them in, so I've had to break open the the old rods. I'll give a little shout out to the mounts. A lot of people still ask me, still ask me, what I use in terms of mounts. I use cornfield crappie gear. I use this folding mount right here. There's a lot of great Shut up, geese. There's a lot of uh, great products they have there. I just happen to go with the bridge. It's a custom-made bridge. That's this guy right here. And I actually had a plate made to move that unit closer to me. And that way, I when I reach, it's a very short reach. I don't have to bend over to reach. Um, and that's what I use there. On this over here, corn Cornfield Fishing Gear, I use the double mount setup. That's a 126 SV, which I don't know how long I'm gonna keep that on there, but we're, we're, we still got it on there. It's a double mount right there, really low profile. And I love it, I love their stuff. Um, Mark over there is doing a great job, and that guy right there is just, uh, you can fold that down for safety, boat cover on. So I really appreciate it. Appreciate them for uh, putting it on my boat because they do great customer service so check them out cornfield fishing gear i'm sure they got some black friday deals as well all these companies do man you gotta check them out hog fishing don't want to forget that hogfishing.com they've got all of their nets right now if you buy is a uh, under a hundred dollars i think it's like 97 dollars or something that's a heck of a deal so 
anyway here we go bass cat i don't know i don't know bass cats got a black friday deal i'm sure they do though at some level love my bass cat and sns marine over there in Seville, indiana Thanks for watching 3 Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies.